I'm going to do my 39 week vlog um, at my doctor's appointment this past week. Um, I was still only a centimeter dilated. Um, nothing more was really said about inducing besides she had, uh, she had me go get an ultrasound done because I was measuring a little bit ahead. But, um, and that would determine how long they would let me go past my due date or if they would let me go past my due date or whatnot. But baby was measuring about 7 pounds, 4 ounces, so I really don't know what's going to go on. I guess I'll find out more at my next appointment. Um, I finally got my baby book. I'll show you that. finally got my baby book. Um, I just got this one at Target. It's about $15. And I think it was really cute. So I finally got my baby book. Um, and we finally got our diaper genie. I'll show you that in a little bit. Um, we didn't get the diaper genie elite. We just got the diaper genie 2. It was cheaper. So we just got the two instead of the elite. Um, finally have the swing at my house. Thank goodness. I'll show you that too. Um, we've been going on walks like every night almost now. And as far as I know, it's not doing anything. So, um, Besides, tonight when we went on our walk, um, I started to have this, like, it's like a really sharp pain in the side, in the right side of my belly, and, um, and then it started to go down to, like, my pelvic area, but it, like, and then I got home and sat down, and it was still there for a little bit, and, like, it hurt, and, like, I would bend a certain way, and then now it's just gone, so... Um, we've got a tour of the Women and Infant Center at our childbirth class this past week. Um, so, that's good. I was, I wanted to get that out of the way this week to, um, uh, make sure just in case I didn't make it to this next class, but I have a feeling I will. Um, I'm trying to keep busy with everything, you know, like, I'm just, I'm just trying to keep busy to make time go faster, but it doesn't seem to be working. It seems like this next week is just going to drag on and on and on and on. I just want at least Thursday to come quickly, so, because then I'll know a little more by Thursday. Um... I decided I'm probably not going to do a room tour. I'll probably end up doing that after she's born. Um, just because I'll have more stuff put together by then and everything. So I think I'm just going to wait to do it until after she's here. Um, so yeah. But I don't know if, you know, if I work up the energy to do it be, between all my other cleaning that I'm doing. I might, but if I don't, I will do one eventually. Um, Nick still has not found another job, which really, really sucks. I don't know, like... I don't know what's going to happen or anything, and it just sucks. So, hopefully soon, but I don't know. Uh, nesting has really set it. I've been in overload mode the past couple days. Like, 
I was doing dishes at like 1, 2 o'clock in the morning just because it was bugging me because there was dirty dishes and I wanted to get them out of the way. I was like, no, I have to get them done. And it was like 1, 2 o'clock in the morning. I was like, this is ridiculous. I should not be cleaning at 1 in the morning, but I was. My feet and ankles have started to swell so bad. I think it's not like bad, bad, but they're definitely starting to swell. And like, I was hoping they wouldn't, but they definitely have. They're not huge, but you can tell they're swollen. Like, and I'm retaining water right now. So hopefully it's a good thing. And I mean, labor is going to come soon. Because if so, that would be awesome. I've been uh, getting really, really, really annoyed very easily. Things get on my nerves so f easily now, it's not even funny. Like one minute I can be perfectly fine, the next minute... <coughs> Excuse me. The next minute, I'm like, you know, just shut up because you're annoying me. And, like, I feel bad because I do it to Nick a lot, but I just can't help it. Like, just things get on my nerves, and it's just, like, nuts. And it's just, like, if it's getting on my nerves, I don't want to be around it, or I just want somebody to shut up. Really is what I want. <laughs> um... I'll put pictures of the ultrasound at the end of this video, more than likely. Like, one of them, like, you can't really see too much in them, but you can see. So, I'll put those at the end of this video. Um, when we went on our walk Friday night... I started to have what seemed to be contractions while we were walking and we get home and I sit down and they stopped it's so discouraging you know being a week from my due date and she's still not here and there's people that are due after me that have already had their babies and it's just so discouraging I just like, it gets me down and, like, upset because she's not here yet and I just want her here. And, like, it's ridiculous. Like, it's just so discouraging. Like, you know, I feel like I'm going to be pregnant forever and I'm never going to have this baby. And, like, it upsets me. So, hopefully she gets here soon. So, I just want her to get here. Like, I am so done with being pregnant and like I guess I'm just at that point where I just want to be done and I, I just want to have my baby in my arms and it just doesn't seem like it's ever going to happen so hopefully she's here soon because I'll it'll be so much better um if you haven't watched my hospital bag video Please watch it because at one point I show you the outfits for um, what I want her to go home in. Um, the first two are still an option, but the third one is not. Um, and I have another one picked out. I guess I'll show you that real quick. But I don't think it's going to be a good idea because it's jeans with a onesie. I don't think I really want to put her in jeans right after she's born. So I probably want to, I'm just not going to show you it because it's pointless. Oh, I got one other thing. We went to Target the other day. Um, let me see what Target is.
Okay. Ooh, crap. Did it stop? Oh, I thought I hit a button. Sorry. Um, but we didn't get a thermometer. So I bought this. I put it in a baggie. Um, because I didn't know where else. Because it comes with the fever chart with it. And so it tells you what what is considered a fever if you do it in their in up their butt their ear underarm or oral but obviously this one's gonna be oral because it's a pacifier thermometer but that's I got a pacifier thermometer because all the other thermometers that I like I wanted the, the dermal one that you do on their forehead those are like fifty dollars so I got that one and that one should be good. And I picked up this. It's a little formula cup. And I got that. And then I also got this. It's for when you're like out in public or something and there's nowhere to throw their diapers throw them in the little baggies. So, I thought that was really neat. So I got that. And if you haven't watched my hospital bag video, here's my diaper bag. thought it was so cute. <sighs> but yeah, that's my diaper bag. So that's about it. I will show you the diaper you need, show you the swing, and yeah. So I'll show you the diaper genie, show you the swing, and then that's going to be it. And I'll show you my belly, and um, my doctor's appointment is Thursday. So. If I find anything out that day, and I'm not going to make it to my due date, I will make a video that day. But if I plan to make it to my due date, and they're not going to induce me until after my due date, I will not make another video until I'm 40 weeks. Unless I somehow go into labor before then, without knowing. But plan on not seeing another video probably till 40 weeks. So probably not for another week. But maybe we'll get lucky. But there's the diaper genie. Just the simple diaper genie too. Nothing special. Opens like that and you put the diapers in there. So that's that. Let's see if I can get up. And here's the swing. If you haven't watched my last week's video, that's the bouncer. And here's the swing. It's got a bunch of different speeds. And then also... It turns like that. And then this, the mobile goes. Let's see. The leaves go down and up. Hmm. Yeah. That's that. So I'll show you my belly because I've only got about a minute. Thirty-nine weeks. So hopefully I'll see you next week. Bye.